Or is 862? Venerus Avosa, who is female EOV after he had endured all the suffering and the pain. So it was obvious Eov's love, his pure love, his faithful love, was seen and obvious. Ubord Levovo Lekeo. And the purity of his heart to God, Lamish Nistapiko, who questioned it initially. Lesovlo to be able to suffer and tolerate what he did. This nadvo babedus mamono gufo. This nadvo, with the loss of his money and the, and, and the physical pain, and he did not condemn God's judgment. Voma b'mashe'ona b'chaveirov he says, this is what he responded to his colleagues. He says, even if you should kill me, I will wait for him. God praised him for his unswerving faith and love, but he did not praise his friends, his colleagues, his peers, for rebuking him. You did not speak properly about me as your colleague Eov, as my servant Eov, at Baomro Noach Doniel Viov Hemo Bitsit Kosom Inotful Nashom Noach Daniel and Eov through their righteousness they saved themselves, they saved their souls. Bakar Shova Lukimes Shvuso Kumosh Omar Kosu Vashem Shovas Shvus Yov. He says then Hashem restored Eov what was taken from him. Quotes a posuk. Noach Doniel Viov Hemabitkosim Yinotzl Nafsham. They through their righteousness they saved themselves. Okay? Even though Noah failed. Right? Noah failed. The Mabel is referred to as May Noah. Despite the fact he failed, it says he still in terms of what he saw and what he endured, the ridicule and the disgrace, right? He still, he remained, Noah with Sadako Yabedorosov. Whatever you want to classify him, Lignai Leshevach, Yeshnorson Lignai Yeshnorson Leshvach, Noah was still, the Torah still says, Sadako Yabedorosov. He's the only one who survived the Mabel. Right, right. Baldato minhogo Hoyukola Hasid Mushonam Manusim. He says Eov's attitude approach were emulated by all the early pious ones who experienced trials. Could the Daniel the Khaverov the Govaroyos the Kipsha Noish right Daniel Daniel was thrown into the lion's pit and Khanim Shol Vazario they were thrown into the kiln. Vaso Rugi Malchus, even though Morris says we just had, Ache couldn't deal with it. Right? When Ache saw, the question is, when he saw the child falling to his death, or he saw the tongue of, uh, who was it, Chutzbis Hamaturgamon, he saw a, a pig. He said, how the tongue that spoke words of holiness, how could it be, be drawn, be dragged by, by the pig in the, in, the, in the dirt? It's something he, he it was too much for him to tolerate. As I always say, you know, in terms of Holocaust survivors, the first of the Harugi Malchus, that was the easy one. It's the colleagues who saw the first one being tortured that they didn't have any question. And they were ready to give their lives. 
Many of the Holocaust survivors, the one who died, it was easy for them. They died, finished. It's the ones who survived, they're the ones who have the questions. Why did they perish if they survived? I mean, it's a combination, guilt, many, many other things, you know. And they wish they would have died. To, because to live with the pain of what they saw and what they experienced, it was, it was just too much for them. They would have preferred to die, many of them. As their families died. It's interesting. I mean, you know, you know, there's an expression, misery loves company. At one time, a person had children. Many of them didn't survive uh, childhood, infancy. Many of them. So, a person lost a child. A person had certain, w was, there were epidemics and plagues and whatever it was. People died continuously. It was not unheard of that people didn't survive beyond um, even the t teenage years. Because it's inevitable, there was a plague, there was a pogrom, there was something, always something was happening. So therefore what? So what, what claim could you have against Hashem? Right? This, this was the daily fare that people experienced. So it's what, pe if people get used to many things. And there's no question. That becomes, that becomes the routine. Even, even suffering is the routine. But when a person doesn't have it, and chas v'sholem, there's a change. And despite the change, the person is still steadfast in his belief and his love, that's already, that, that's considered something special. To be continued. It's a reason. That's it. What? Sure. expression they were made of different stuff these people yeah not going back that far 60 70 years ago different world you know they said the difference between the Vietnam War they took the kids 18 hours off campus they're ready in Vietnam you know what I mean eight or from six weeks basic training they were Vietnam where were you you were in, 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 in Ivy League College wherever you were unless you were ROTC so, could they deal with, with, with the war? They went to World War II, who did these people, what did these people live through? The Depression, barely had what to eat, they fought for every moment of their existence. And whatever they had, they fought for, they gave their lives for. So, we're not giving it up so easily. It's a whole different reality of a person.